fed up with organized coach tours to see the sights of one of the world's great capitals? Don't want to pay taxi fares? It's certainly tough to walk the long streets of this metropolis. Well, how about hopping onto one of China's most popular forms of transport to explore Beijing, an electric bike or e-bike? Nathan C, founder of Beijing Electric Bike Tours, has built his tours around e-bikes, and the routes he has designed provide a new perspective on popular Beijing destinations, allowing people to explore areas not often visited by tourists. And after I moved here for about a year or so, one of my friends came to visit. My friend was also he was a big rider, so he ended up taking it around. He went around the corner. Maybe five minutes had passed. Ten minutes had passed. Um, so I was getting kind of worried. Like I don't know what happened to him. Maybe he got lost. Maybe something happened. He came back and he said the first thing he walked through the door was, "Wow, that was amazing." And I was like, "What was amazing?" And he's like, "Oh, well, I got lost in some back alleys or something like that around my neighborhood." So at that, at that point in time, he he just blurted out accidentally, "You should do this as a as a tour business." To find out more on how wonderful this experience is, we followed Nathan and his guide to explore the route in detail. Generally, riders meet at Suchi Co Subway Station and prepare for departure. Then the guide will take them to Xianyu Co Street through some small traditional Beijing hutongs. Well, this street is called Xianyu Co. This means a fresh fish market because in the past there was a river here. In the, on the river there was a right. A usually a fisherman. Saw the their fish uh, in front of the bridge. Later, the market uh, formed, and uh, uh, then uh, this street was given the name uh, Fresh uh, Fish Market. After passing along this traditional street, they go to Dashi Lan to explore Beijing's history. How much is this? Give it five uh, baht. Eight hundred ramenbi, which is around more than a hundred dollars. His website has attracted many visitors. Since it launched in 2009, it's helped many overseas tourists who prefer electric bikes because they're faster and more flexible than other forms of transport. They're also a good way to avoid Beijing's daily traffic jams. Wow, it's such a great feeling. I've been here before, just uh, you know, taking walk, but it's around five kilometers, so it's a pretty, a pretty big area. Totally different feeling. You go around areas, you stop a little bit, and the guide explains you the routes and the history behind this uh, area. And going through these, uh, you know, hutongs, the traditional Chinese buildings, is a uh, you know great experience. 普通的方式就是啊、呃，你只是去故宫。天坛、颐和园、长城这几个地方，啊，这就像几个点，你就空降到那个点，然后你不知道你怎么来的，你不知道呃呃他们之间的联系，甚至，呃，但是我们这个电动车呢，就是把所有的地方串联起来，你知道每一个地点在每一在城市的哪个位置。Understanding a city is just like understanding a person. You need to know their past and story. Visiting Beijing by electric bike can allow tourists to find more about Beijing and to better understand its past and future.